Hi, Graham here again from Bainbridge Technologies. Today I'd like to talk to you about the importance of having a DC to DC charger in your four-wheel drive uh, for your auxiliary battery and especially lithium batteries. The main reason basically is a lot of the alternators in your vehicles aren't up to scratch these days to have enough current to be able to contribute to both your starting battery and your auxiliary battery and keeping them both 100% charged. So by having that external DC to DC charger option from your alternator, you're putting that charge directly into your auxiliary battery and dedicated to that auxiliary battery. So you're keeping it up to charge and the importance of that is obviously you don't want to get stranded out on a couple of day holiday and your fridge runs flat because, uh, or it turns off basically because your batteries run flat. So the importance of a DC to DC is imperative in, in that situation. So uh, it keeps you 100% charged and on the road and uh, off road and off grid for a lot longer. Now you can go to an external DC to DC such as the SeaTech and the Bainbridge 40 amp hour, uh, which are both uh, great units in, the, in their own right. And if you've already got one of those in your vehicle, you're going the right path. But if you do go down the line of looking at a new lithium battery, our fantastic new Bainbridge range of lithium batteries, there's the option there for you to have the DC to DC built into the unit. So this unit here is a 150 amp hour battery um, with a 20 amp hour DC to DC built in. Now, the other beauty of that is it's no extra wires to put in. You haven't got to worry about hooking it back to your ignition if you've got a smart alternator vehicle so it doesn't turn off when the alternator turns off and so to speak. It's all taken care of by the battery. You literally have positive and negative come into the battery from your starting or cranking battery in the front of the car. And then the internal um, VSR of this unit will latch on at 13 volts and turn off at 12.5 volts. So it's not gonna drain the power and kill the battery power and you'll always have power to start your car, but it will still, by all means, keep this thing charged and keep your fridge and all your accessories in the car going for a lot longer. So one of the main reasons is said, having it all built in in one unit also gives you the option of taking this out and moving it around. And as long as you've got a battery connected to a starter battery, your charge is with you. You haven't got something that's permanently mounted in a vehicle that you've got to keep taking in and out. So fantastic for that device um, and gives you a few other options as well. This unit here with the DC to DC built in, the battery, you can have it charging in or out. So that also means that the the DC to DC in here from the lithium battery can charge out to other batteries. So it is becomes a 20 amp charger, a portable 20 amp charger. So that's a fantastic feature. So they're just a couple of reasons why you should have a dedicated DC to DC in your vehicle to charge an auxiliary battery. So for any more information, please click on the link below.